with the hot so where the walking street uh, is receiving heat in this heat exchanger between B and C. So this is an isobaric uh, heat transfer because uh, we can neglect here the uh, pressure losses so we can consider that uh, the pressure remains constant uh, here in this heat exchanger. Uh, so uh, then applying the first principle of thermodynamics because uh, there's no moving part, uh, there's also uh, no uh, technical work uh, exchange between B and C, so uh, Q, the heat transfer between B and C is directly equal to the uh, specific enthalpy variation between B and C. Once again, uh, because we have an ideal gas and we can also consider uh, that uh, the thermophysic properties and here in particular the CP is constant, we can express uh, this uh, heat, heat received by the gas uh, as uh, the product of the CP times the variation of temperature between B and C and uh, once again we want to express uh, this only as a function of input parameters uh, so CP is an input parameter because it's a property of the fluid. TC is an input parameter, uh, but parameter because it's usually um, defined as, as uh, the maximum temperature which can be admitted at the inlet of the turbine. And TB was already expressed before as a function of input parameters uh, with the uh, inlet temperature in A and uh, the ratio uh, of compression uh, delta and uh, the Laplace coefficient. So uh, therefore it's uh, possible to express uh, QBC, the heat received by the fluid, only as a function of input parameters uh, when it's exchanging heat with the hot source.